a scientist who worked at Area 51, before he passed away revealed some surprising secrets about aliens, UFOs, and technology that makes things float, like anti-gravity. But if you think this is wild, just wait until you watch the entire video. But before that I just have a little request. Join our Patreon community because this support on Patreon directly helps us to do research and bring quality content to you, without any sponsorships. Now if you are curious to know more about this then hit that like and subscribe button and dive with me into this video. It was August 7, 2014, Boyd Bushman, an American senior aerospace engineer, who worked for a long time at Lockheed Martin, passed away. Before he died, he made a remarkable video where he talked about Area 51, mentioned advanced propulsion systems being experimented with there, and even shared pictures he claimed showed an alien. Boyd Bushman worked as a senior research engineer for companies like Lockheed Martin, Texas Instruments, and Hughes Aircraft. He was known for his involvement in developing the Stinger missile. Bushman's fascination with UFOs and anti-gravity technology became evident in 1999, when he featured in a Discovery Channel documentary discussing secret aircraft technology with Nick Cook, an author and writer for Jane's Defense. Initially, Bushman didn't reveal much, but later on, he opened up about his keen interest in anti-gravity. Later, in 2007, Bushman appeared in a lesser-known documentary called From Here to Andromeda by David Serrata. In this documentary, Bushman delves further into his thoughts on UFOs and anti-gravity. In 2008, Bushman underwent a polygraph test where he confessed to working with anti-gravity technology at Area 51, being involved in alien technologies, studying an alien spacecraft, and even claiming to have made physical contact with an alien being. He also mentioned his acquaintance with Lazar. He shared UFO photos he had received, some of which depicted ships that were supposedly very close to the photographer but were hard to see clearly. He also showed a picture of a blurry light, which he claimed was what the crafts looked like when they powered up. Next, he showcased a series of photographs featuring an alien being. The creature resembled what one might imagine an alien to look like, with a large head and eyes. He described them as having five fingers, five toes, two eyes, and webbed feet. They are about five feet tall, ranging from four and a half to five feet. Some of them were reported to be as old as 230 years. According to Bushman, there are at least 18 of these beings that exist and function in their facility. According to Bushman, the US military is not only interacting with the aliens themselves but also with the spacecraft that have managed to reach us. Additionally, he believes that a team of specialists works around the clock to study alien technologies obtained through various means. Bushman proceeded to share the story of his friend who reportedly shot down an alien spacecraft and entered it. However, he emphasized that working with alien technology is often perilous for humans. According to Bushman, 39 individuals have lost their lives while attempting to reverse engineer UFOs, with 19 fatalities occurring during a technology test about a year and a half ago. Though he was somewhat vague about the specifics, he mentioned that they attempted to bring different flying crafts close to the UFO, which then defended itself, resulting in the deaths of 19 people from their team. The entire situation could easily be dismissed as the fantastical tales of an elderly individual. However, what gives one pause is Bushman's background. Why would a highly respected scientist start fabricating such outlandish stories? Let us know that what do you think about this? If you want to see more such videos then hit that subscribe button and I will see you in the next video. Of the unknown, where the truth is revealed no longer alone. Terry Moore brings the fire, spitting facts. Conspiracy theories ain't no turning back. Shining light on the secrets they conceal.